They say, we should all bring our naira and give it to them again. That they want to change it. Eh? Is that our priority? No. I am an economist. I can tell you categorically that this policy by the federal government, by the Central Bank of Nigeria, has no basis in economics. There is no reason to. This is purely political. Viewers and subscribers, welcome back again on this platform. This is BVI Channel 1, where we tell you on adulterated truth. This time, I'm going to be saying things based on permutation. Okay? And I could be wrong, but if I am, I want you to confirm it on the comment section. But I can tell you, this is the hard truth some of us may not know. That Bugari is waging a war against Tinibu and some other politicians that believe it is their turn and they are cabals to run this country. Let me tell you this. Since after Tinibu made this statement, Buhari ni soka mabalo. Only the present. Oje kini oluye olule. Oje keji olule. Oje keda olule. Oje soko lori television. Yoruba loko. I can tell you, as a Fulani man, in the character of Bugari, they never forget and they don't forgive. Bugari will teach Tinibu the lesson he will understand the hard way. You have boasted that you made him president. Oya, come and make yourself president. You have won the APC. You have um, twisted the presidency and collected APC presidential candidate. Oya, go to the field and win. Some of you will say, where am I coming from? The CBN declaration of redesigning the Naira. These challenges primarily include one, significant hoarding of banknotes by members of the public with statistics showing that over 85% of currency in circulation are outside the vaults of our commercial banks. To be more specific, as at the end of September 2022, available data at the CBN indicate that 2.73 trillion Naira out of the 3.23 trillion naira currency in circulation was outside the vaults of commercial banks across the country and supposedly held by members of the public. Evidently, currency in circulation has more than doubled since 2015, rising from 1.46 trillion in December 2015 to 3.23 trillion as of September 2022. I must say that this is a very a worrisome trend that cannot continue to be allowed. In recent years, the CBN has recorded significantly higher rates of counterfeiting, especially at the higher denominations of 500 and 1,000 naira notes, bank notes. Although global best practice is for central banks to redesign, produce, and circulate new local legal tender every five to eight years, our existing series of banknotes, the Naira, has not been redesigned in the last 20 years. The bank remains resolutely determined to achieve the objective of its mandate as enshrined in Section 2B of the CBN Act of 2007 
to ensure a strong and effective legal tender. It is therefore no longer tenable to continue with business as usual, especially given the continually evolving circumstances that could impeach the optimal performance of our Naira. Ladies and gentlemen, on the basis of these trends, problems, and facts set out above, and in line with the provisions of sections 2B, section 18A, and section 19, subsection A and B of the CBN Act 2007, the management of the CBN has sought and obtained the approval of President Muhammad Buhari to redesign, produce, release, and circulate this new series of banknotes at 200 Naira, 500 Naira, and 1,000 Naira levels. In line with, it, with this approval, we have finalized arrangements for the new currency to begin circulation from December 15, 2022, after its launch by President Muhammad Buhari. The new and existing currencies shall remain legal tender and circulate together until January 31, 2023, when the existing currencies shall cease to be legal tender. Many of you don't know, it is a war against some of these politicians, the elites who have stored up Naira notes they will always use for election purposes. They hold a whole lot of them. Many of them proceeds of corruption, proceeds of stolen public wealth. They stored it up. And I can tell you this. If you like, believe it. If you don't like, believe it. It is based on permutation. That these people you call rich billionaires, they print money. They print money. It is based on permutation. Mm -hmm. I may not have evidence to tell you, to show you where they are printing it or how they are doing it, but write it down somewhere. It is not only happening in Nigeria. These guys print money, they store it up for these purposes. And this quick announcement to change Naira notes design, it will break the back of the camels that calls themselves political juggernauts in this country. Both of APC and of PDP, they store money in safe houses, Store money in bunkers, store money in tanks. Just like the one I had is just going about unverified video about Naira that is being decayed. They are beginning to run around. <laughs> Uh-huh. <laughs> Allah <laughs> <laughs> 
you see i call it unverified because i didn't have time to really provide the video but the bottom line is that it is an evidence to tell you that you know that you know it i don't need to convince you that this man stole naira notes that is why this country <laughs> anyway i'm just telling you this for you to know i'm just telling you this for you to know that bugari is determined you know the people that have billion vans in their houses people that carry bullion vans during the election it is a subtle war between bugari and the juggernauts the jagabans of nigeria the political jagabans hmm? that is just it and that since the announcement that has been my my that is the first thing that struck me this man really want to deal with these politicians they may not have time between the time it will be introduced to the time of the election to go and reprint as usual they will all be forced to bring out that money to deposit back in the bank then <laughs> if efcc is even at work <laughs> now their season be this because people will lodge in criminals these criminals eh, they will lodge in money you never believe it is existing in this country anyway that is just my permutation if you think otherwise i want you to drop drop a comment we are going to start our live broadcast where broadcast where we all have our time to interact in some of these important issues okay we are doing our renovation please stay tuned to this channel we are coming in a way <laughs> that we shake the foundation of this country and retire this political never do wells once and for good bye bye for now don't forget to subscribe like and share drop a comment i want to have your opinion